What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna look for some mouflon. I'm gonna try and get that one mission done. And uh you know, keep continuing with our management that we've been working on. Believe it or not, it was kinda neat. Um I was around in this area. I don't, what was I doing? Oh, well so I had built a another PC and was just testing it out and you see this mark right here well let me see if I can get over to it and I'll show you there was a red deer that was a thousand and ninety three yards and he was I don't know if the blood yeah right here here's the blood small amount of blood you can see animal survive whatever but Regardless, I had this 30-06. It was the uh, the it's the Remington 1903. I wish there was like an inspection button, that, you know, showed the gun or whatever. Anyways, so I had noticed something when the the settings are turned down and the gun the 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 system that I was using was a is a more of a budget gaming system. Anyway, so I was testing it. And I had to lower a lot of the settings down to be able to, you know, reach my 60 FPS goal or whatever you want to call it. Well, with those settings turned down, you can see a lot better, like a whole lot better. And I was like way over there up on that hill or something like that, you know, that's, a, that's pretty much where I was, Some, something like that. I don't, I don't know. But anyway... And it was way over here, and this is where I hit it at. It was insane. And it, it was it was kind of fun because I missed it like the first three shots. But it was so far away that it didn't even go anywhere. And then on that last time, I actually hit it. But, um, I don't know. I just figured I would share that. I don't really have any proof. I, well, I took a picture of it, of my screen before I pulled the shot just in case I was thinking oh, I might put that on there just to uh, just to prove it but I'm uh, I'm not gonna bother <laughs> but anyway like I said I figured I'd share that I thought it was kind of cool but if we would have had our 308 the Lapua I bet we could have gotten it I just think that that distance is just too far for this you know for this particular gun but anyway yeah so let's get to it Let's see if we can hunt down some mouflon and get this mission here. Uh, where is, is this one? Yes. So we'll activate that one. Harvest five one young mouflons. All right. Ooh, look here. Looks like a giant herd of red deer. Oh my god. Look at that guy. I wonder what he is. Got to get closer. Check out that herd, though. I don't think I've seen that many together all at once. I wonder if it's two herds traveling together. How far is that? 305. we got to get just a little closer to be able to get a read on them. We're probably going to get just in the wrong place. So we can't really see them here in a second. That's my guess. Probably go right down the side of that hill. I just noticed them too, and I had kind of looked over that direction a minute ago. Awesome view. Uh, if anybody's interested, this is where I am on the map. It's kind of up here. We've been up here before. And I figured that I would kind of check this area. I know we have a little bit of action right here for some move line. I was thinking about going up through that way. And maybe, you know, we could cut through here, too, because we've got all that extra area that we haven't seen yet. Well, I guess, technically, that's kind of this area, and over here. Yeah, these these guys are really close. Yeah, she's alerted, so there's no way I'm going to get close to them. All right, that's fine. I'm just going to go ahead and head back in the other direction. I may be able to go around. I'm sitting here pointing, like, I can show you where I'm going to go. <laughs> anyway... Like that direction, kind of go around there up high on where the road is. Check these guys out. I've been tracking them for a while. 
It's, uh, it's like they're curious. Kind of walking straight towards me and they're looking right at me. What is this guy? Mature two star? This is that same herd we saw earlier. <laughs> Look at him. I'm just like, what is that? I mean, they're really close. I need to see what that little buck is back behind them. I say buck. That bull. Come on, y'all. Move out of the way so I can tell what he is. I'm assuming he's probably like... Look at this guy. That is so cool. He's about to spook in a second. Without a doubt. No, he's a mature. Alright. We're going to take him. If we can, if we can get get away with it. Oh, my range is way too far up. Okay, here we go. All right, where'd he go? There he is. Yeah, that was a good hit. I think he's not going to go very far. Not very far. The sound of this. This uh, gun is really cool, too. Yeah, he laid down right there. We'll give him a second. Well, that was pretty rewarding. That was a really good stalk right there. It was pretty difficult, too, because the wind was blowing right at them. I'm just surprised that they were walking straight towards me. That kind of threw me off a little bit. But regardless, we got him. We got him. All right. Should be good to go now. I'm going to go ahead and head down there and see what we got. Yeah, here he is. He didn't make it too far. I was actually surprised that that's what he was. I figured that he would have been... What is... Look at that. He's steaming. That's so cool. That is so cool. So if you're not familiar, um, if it's really cold outside and uh, you harvest an animal, right after they've had, they will be steaming. It's just, you know, their body's putting off so much heat or whatever. That's a really neat addition. I don't, I don't think they had that before, did they? I've never noticed this. And it may just be because of the light or whatever. But really awesome touch. What kind of shot did we make on it? It was just uh, long. Yeah, this uh, this gun is definitely not, not quite strong enough. It made good penetration. No, that's not too bad. I was thinking it was not quite strong enough, but as close range as that was, that's not an issue. The bullet did stop right there, though. All right, anyway, let's have a look. Yeah, check that out, 15%. Wow, good bit of money for him too. Cool deal. Let's head on and see what else we can get into. So we just happened across a brown bear, it seems. We had found this little watering hole and found where they had been drinking often. And there's one right over this hill I don't know if we'll be able to see him or not. I don't know what the the trees and stuff look like over here. It'd be nice if we could get a good sight on him. See what he is. I'm not going to get my hopes up or anything. It's not exactly what we're out to get right now, but... It'd be nice to get a look anyway. I don't know. I don't want that. i binoculars. Oh, check him out. What is he? So a one-star adult male. I don't think we want that, right? Oh, what is this? Okay, so that's adult female. One-star adult male. So the brown bears go together, which I had thought that to start with. I just a one-star adult. I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and take him, and I'm gonna see. 
I'm thinking too much and I can't keep up with which one's what. Okay. So this is... Yeah, there's the female. So where is he gone? He's right behind here. Okay, there he is. Alright, let's see how well this 30 out 6 does. Hmm. Take just a little more. Stop for me there, big guy. Mm, not like that. I want a direct side on because trying to go at an angle, it may mess up. So I had a little interruption. I mess up like this every once in a while. More than I'd like to. But anyway... We got this, uh, we got this bear. And I shot it once. And it seemed like it was maybe going to run off. And then it kind of slowed down a lot. So I put one more shot into it and it dropped immediately. It looked like the shot had went all the way through. But we're going to check it out and see if it did or not. have a look at the first shot curious to see how far it went all right so it didn't go all the way through but it did it did penetrate into the second lung okay and so the second shot i'm assuming the second shot's basically going to be the same double lung nope actually not it stopped it got one lung all right well that's fine we were able to get him and let's see what he looks like. Yeah, 47%. I'm not sure exactly how it works with the the bear, you know, more like the solitary animals. How are you supposed to get better, I guess, better animals, higher star ratings, when you don't have anything to work with as far as your fitness rating? Does it, is it um, a deal where if you harvest one, Will another one come around that has more of a chance to have a higher rating or something? I don't know. It's hard to say. I haven't uh, haven't been able to figure that out either. Well, it's selling. Okay. All right. Good deal. So we'll move on and uh, keep looking. So I moved locations. I'll show you where I am. Came over here because I know that there's active you know, move line in this area. And as soon as I got to the cabin, came out and I scared some move line and they ran down this direction, kind of where we're heading. And I think this is them right down here at the bottom of this hill. But I may have scared them again. Yeah, they're pretty skittish, I think. Oh, what am I missing here? Saw him for a second, but I haven't seen him anymore. Where did it go? And it may not even be them. Oh, gosh. Yeah, they're gone, gone, huh? I'm going to try and pay attention to their sound profile and kind of follow it. Maybe eventually we can get on them. Because right before they got out of sight when I scared them the first time, the only one that I saw was a young male, and that's what we're after. So... With a little patience and a little luck, we'll get on them. Okay, we found some mouflon over here. Now I just got to get into a position to where I can see them, maybe. We saw a female a second ago. Where did she go? They're right on the side. Oh, right there. Okay. I think this is the female. Yeah, mature female. So, where are the other ones with her? That's what we need to find. I like to keep my distance because definitely don't want to scare them. Here we go. Young male, right there. Perfect. Uh, can't tell how far he is. The tree's in the way. I better hurry up. 165. Gonna lose my. I'm gonna lose my chance. I'm gonna lose my chance. Come on. Uh, what am I set at? 164. 
Alright guys, unfortunately, game just crashed when I was trying to uh, get my sight set in on this guy, right? And, of course, able to get back in, but it didn't help us any because this log right here. <laughs> I was moving forward a little bit and it seemed like I scared him off. I'm not getting the indication that they're running, but the game just loaded in. So it probably isn't working. That is unfortunate. Huh. Well, we had the patience part, just not the luck part. I've moved around a lot trying to find some mouflon and uh, ran into this group. But we're not having any luck because all we have... Let's see, adult, mature... So we have two adults and one mature, so while we're here, we may as well take this mature one. 279 yards. Get a little closer here. Just a touch, not a whole lot closer. It'd be nice if we could tell. There he is right there. Wish we could tell which ones were what. A little bit further away. That would be helpful. Knock that up one more notch. All right, yeah, a little bit further there. I wonder if we can lay all the way down. Uh, there we go. We know which one he is. He'll move forward just a little bit. And bam, there we go. Got him. Got him. All right. That doesn't help us on our mission. Ooh, what did I hear? I think that was a chamois I just heard. Yeah, chamois. I'm surprised that didn't scare him. It doesn't help us really, but it does kind of. It kind of helps us with our uh, management goal because we're always doing that. I actually saw a chamois a minute ago that was a three star. So that was pretty. Uh, that was pretty good too. Um, this is a similar. I think this is like the same area we had hit pretty hard and uh, all we were seeing was one star chamois in this area so it was nice to see a three star that uh, lets us know that we are we are making progress it was unfortunate earlier that we didn't get a chance to get that one young mouflon but uh, the game crashing kind of ruined it for us that's all right we'll get on them we'll get them done that just gives us more to do right all right, here's our guy right here. We'll check him out and see how bad he was. Okay, yeah, 41%. Sell him too. It would be nice to be able to get a hold of a, a young mouflon. Oh, what are these guys? Oh, that's our chamois, isn't it? Yeah, it is. So we haven't had much luck. We have... Been working at this for a little while now. And this is kind of neat. There's a group of chamois and a group of roe deer kind of together. I guess they're kind of resting. I just saw a roe deer a second ago that was a mature uh, mature male. I was trying to get my sights on him. And we were going to take him. But I'm not seeing him now. He's probably right behind these trees. I would have to guess. Oh, hello. Am I crouched? Okay, now I am. We just saw a young male mouflon. There he is right there. Nope. Right. He's right there somewhere. Now, if we can just... Where are they going? Are they coming up the hill? Okay, they are. Is this him? Yes, that's him. That's him. That's him. All right. That's him right there. Don't get mixed up. Don't get mixed up. How far? We're dialed in pretty good there. Got him. I 
think he's... Where'd he go? I think we made a solid shot on him. Yeah, they do. Did you see the steam coming off of him? I don't know if you could see that in the uh, in the recording or not. So cool. Does it tell us what the temperature is by chance? I've never paid attention to that. I don't know why. Um, no? I don't see anything about temperature anywhere. Okay. Let's head over here. So, apparently it wasn't a very good shot. Because he survived. I guess we'll track. And, uh... Since we have a blood trail, hopefully... Hopefully it's good enough blood trail to where we can track. Okay, I'm wondering if... I'm wondering if they've changed the way that the blood trails work. Because... I'm not seeing a continuation of it. See this spot, we have this spot, and then we have this spot. But I don't see any other blood. Alright, so I ended up leaving. I hunted around for a while. Didn't have any luck. Came back to the same spot. And we slept until the next morning. And as soon as I came out, they're here in the same spot again. That is, uh, that's kind of nice. I was kind of worried about it because I was afraid that they weren't going to come back. Let's see. He's right here somewhere. There's a mature, there's a mature male there and then the young one is there also. Yeah, that's him right there actually. But I'm going to make 100% sure that we get good this time. Let's do this. Roe deer over there making all kind of racket. Zero in a little bit better. The only thing I can think of earlier is that uh, the shot was too high. And we'll find out. Mm, right behind the bushes. And they're heading down it. I think, I, think, I think they're doing it on purpose. They know I'm here looking at them. Oh, young male right here. Don't move up too far. Don't move up. Yeah, they know. They know I'm here looking at them. They're like, ha ha. Not today, buddy. I guess the only thing we can do is just kind of ease over that way. Hopefully they're, they're going to continue on down that hill. Would you be quiet up there? Be quiet. Crazy old roe deer. Yeah, let's see if we can ease that way. Maybe we'll get lucky. Oh, 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 oh. Where are they headed now? They move around so much, don't they? They're pretty fast. They don't just ease, ease along. When they change their mind on where they're going, they go. Full commit. Come on, bushes. You're hurting me here. All right, here we go. Got this guy. And... Hey, we got him that time. Without a doubt. Without a doubt. Okay, we found him. Uh, let's see. It looks like he made it just a, just a little ways. A couple steps and then went down all right yeah this is and this is the same one that we shot the first time so I'm I'm willing to bet when we do this it's not gonna count but let's see yeah that's what happened look how high that shot was I, I think my I didn't have my scope zeroed in quite right it was a little too far out I didn't judge it properly okay so let's sell it and see hey it did count Good deal. I was afraid that it wasn't going to count. I'll tell you what. This... Where are you at? Where are you at? This hunting session has been a mess. <laughs> it really has. The, uh... 
the game crashing and everything else and little interruptions and whatnot but we still got some stuff done it's pretty good pretty good what is it oh you're gonna hide in the trees up there aren't you have a look and see so I'm pretty sure this is that same group they've got a mature one star male with them and he's probably one up there hollering distracting me um, oh that's a two star mature where's this guy at I don't know. I don't see him. I don't see him. Anyway. So it was a... It was, like I said, it was a mess of a hunt today. It was still fun. I enjoyed it. I hope y'all uh, enjoyed it too. But anyway. Next episode, I guess we'll kind of keep going. Keep grinding. Doing some more of the, uh, the herd management along the way. I mean, we're kind of at that point. That's about all that we can do do some herd management and uh try to get this other move line the other couple move line if we can get one in i'll be happy um so just kind of do some passive hunting whatever just taking it easy enjoying the game so i appreciate y'all for watching hope to see y'all in the next one like subscribe y'all have a great day goodbye